Okay, so we uh, so the gaffer's here. So let's. Uh, <laughs> Frank's coming. Let's go to the gaffer. Right, and there's a. Uh, uh, Congratulations. There's an awful lot of things. Yeah. There's an awful lot of things that we would like to talk to Frank about. Flo can come every week. <laughs> we're, we're allowed to touch. Are we okay? Yeah, fine. I don't know. Uh, whatever. Um, we were just saying, one to eleven, and there must be a million things that pleased you about that because everyone seemed to play well. From from your old boys, Pedro and Ollie, and, and then Billy in the middle there. I mean, th there was so much to like about that. Yeah, that, and you have to against Liverpool. You have to play well because they're so good. They made some changes. So did we. They still have quality that can hurt you, the way they play, they, make you, they stretch you defensively big time. You have to defend 1v1, you have to get up the pitch and get across the pitch. And you have to also have personality that when you have the ball, you can keep the ball and move the ball where you give them their own problems. And we did everything tonight. We did everything considering um, the, the level of opposition, considering where we're at and where we know where we're working to try and get to. And we've not been consistent at times this year. There's a little template for you tonight of the, the work ethic and the spirit and the quality that we need. Billy Gilmore. I mean, Incredible. wow. First 45 minutes, by some distance, the best player on the pitch. His first touch, mm. everything was controlled. Mm. He knew exactly his position, knew exactly where the ball was going to go. I mean, what a performance. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't want to... It's easy to assess it as, oh, Billy, a kid. Let's, let's talk about it before. You, you just assess him as a top performance today. He, you know, if a, if a world-class midfield player plays like that, you go, yeah, you understand it. Puts his foot in. Uh, always available, wants to make angles, plays the right pass, uh, travels through midfield at the right time. Um, uh, he's, you know, he's quite slight in his stature, Billy, and people go, oh, he looks like a boy. He's huge in his personality. He's huge in his personality and his talent. I'm delighted for him. Really feet are on the ground as well, really down to earth. I was there the day he signed with his family a few years ago. I've seen him uh, develop. Um, he's got work to do. He knows that, though. But that performance was, was great. Stunning. And you're going to need him. Um, because you haven't got any other midfielders yeah. now. Uh, I don't know how Kovacic is, but N'Golo's still out. And obviously, Jorginho, you're missing for the next three Ruben, games, Ruben. all in all. Yeah. So, um, I mean, he, he can't not start, can he, against Everton? We'll, we'll, he? we'll see. He's definitely given himself a good <laughs> chance, no matter what. To be fair, whether the selection of others or not, I think the way he played it gives him a chance anyway. But, yeah, we've got, we've got injury problems. But sometimes, that you know, you can cry about him a lot, and I probably do sometimes. But well, we don't think you do at all compared to other people. No, got, I don't know who you're talking about there. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, no, but it's there to say we had them at the start of the season, and, and we had them now in this period. And when you're talking about N'Golo Kante, you're talking about the best midfielder in the world there or thereabouts everyone knows that Ruben Loftus-Cheek hasn't kicked a ball played last night um, felt okay but he knows he hasn't he's not match fit there so we'll have to work around it but when you see the performance of Ross Barkley tonight of Mason Mount tonight um, uh, we'll have enough options what, what's more important is not what 11 I put out against Everton it's that they bottle that spirit and show the same work ethic to, to try and get the right result We've been joined by uh, another guest. Uh, man of the match, I believe he was given by... Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, everyone, to be fair. Billy, well played. Yeah. Well played. Uh, you must have absolutely loved that. Yeah, it was a great game. Uh, come in here to start and play really well and most of all to get through to the next round is uh, brilliant. And uh, into the next round, but deservedly so. That's, I mean, that's a top Liverpool team now. I know they didn't have all their starters started, but all over the pitch we were, we were so strong. Yeah, tonight I thought we'd done really well, obviously coming back from a couple of bad results. Uh, but no, today we were brilliant. Uh, every every ball we were challenging for, it, Ross with the goal, it just sums up how good we were when we uh, attacked them. Uh, but no, the game plan went right and uh, that's what saved us through, so it's good. Billy, watching every, everything you did in the first half, your first touch was exceptional your first thing you did the touch and then the pass the, you grew into the game almost instantaneous did, 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 is that how it felt for you that's how it looked uh, during the game uh, just had to go through a lot of plays we've been doing in training just kind of remembering them uh, and that's what we've done going into midfield play around outside and we knew that Liverpool were going to play a high line so the amount of times we got in behind them by the switches of play and it worked so I just thought I'd keep doing that doing that and then when it started to get, try and get turned and play forward, uh, and it happened, so it was really good. There was also a challenge on the edge of their box where <laughs> you had to go in and win it. It looked like you enjoyed that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I enjoyed that. <laughs> uh, but no, that's what I mean. Uh, most folk would say, because I'm small, I wouldn't do that, but I love a good taco, and uh, I've done two tacos tonight and two came out on top, so that was good. <laughs> Glasgow boy, made of stern <laughs> yeah. stuff. Um, and you might be in midfield on your own on Sunday. We were just talking about that. If Kovacic is injured, Jorginho's banned and Golo's not back yet, you're going to have to hold it all together maybe here on Sunday. Well, hopefully uh, they're back. So it is uh, Kova. Hopefully he's fit. 
Uh, but no, tonight was good and hopefully we can take that on to the weekend. Well, thanks for joining us, Billy and Flo. It's been well great done. to have you back. And, Cheers, Flo. Uh, Chelsea, Thank old you. and new. Well done, young man. And uh, it's been a wonderful night at Stamford Bridge. Uh, man of the match, Billy Gilmore. Special guest, Flo. Great being back here. And from Jason and I and all of us, it is good night. Chelsea through to the quarterfinal. <laughs>